Yo, so what's going on guys, it's your boy Laser Gaming. welcome back to another GTA 5 video. So a few days ago I uploaded a top 3 best rare paint jobs video, and as I promised in that video, if it reached over a thousand likes, I'd post a new paint job video straight away, and you guys absolutely smashed the likes on that video. So I will leave a link to that paint job video down low in the description in case you guys haven't seen it yet. But seeing as you guys really appreciate me putting 3 paint jobs in one video, I thought they only made sense that I went ahead and put together another top 3 best rare paint job videos and all three of these colors are very different so i guarantee there'll be at least one paint job in this video that all of you guys will like straight away so as always if you guys do enjoy these paint job videos do be sure to show support by dropping a like down below because because if this video reaches over a thousand likes i give you my word i'll be posting another paint job video straight away now in the top right of this video there's going to be a little link at the end of the video i want you guys to vote for your favorite paint job in this video there's three paint jobs all together and like i said in the top right if you click Click that little i button you should get the vote option to drop down and the reason i want you guys to vote for the favorite paint job is because whatever paint job wins the vote i will be setting that as the crew color tonight for the next three nights and then throughout then i'm going to continually change the crew color with all of the colors in this video so like i said if you guys are already in my crew then you'll be getting these colors straight away you don't have to go ahead and change anything that i'm going to show you how to do in this video but what i will say is my crews usually do fill up very quickly so check back in about an hour after I've posted this video and I will be kicking some inactive members from the crew so some of you guys can come and join. I do currently have five GTA 5 crews, Laser Gang which is for all platforms, Laser Gaming Crew which is for all platforms, Laser Gaming PS4 for the PS4 players, Laser Gaming X1 for the Xbox One members and finally Laser Gaming PC for the PC gamers. Please only join the crew on the platform you guys play on. I can check if you've got a PSN or an Xbox Live gamer tag linked to your social club so there'll just be no point in joining the crew on a platform you don't play on because there's hardly going to be any active members on there anyway so there will be a link to all five of my crews down low in the description however without further ado let's get into the video Okay, so coming in for the very first paint job in this video, and this is probably one of the most unique colors I've covered ever on my channel, and this is called the Laser Honeycomb Hive. As you guys can see in the intro, it is an extremely unique and rare color because it changes between orange, yellow, and golden consistently, and you just can't really get anything like this color in the game currently. Now, I would suggest applying this paint job to a car that does have a lot of curves or a lot of sharp edges, just so it does a mix between the orange and the yellow, really creating that honeycomb color feel to it. Nonetheless, the first thing you guys want to do is put the base color as metallic black. Once you guys have done that, you want to back out and you want to apply the crew color as your primary. Now, here's the RGB code for the crew color. I will also leave a link to this down below in the description. However, as you guys can see by this color right here, it looks nothing to the color that I had in the intro of the video. Now, once you guys apply the crew color, don't worry. As you guys can see, it does look very nice as it is, but it looks nothing compared to what we're going to be making this color into. So, once you guys have applied the crew color to the primary so the pearlescent that we want to add over this crew color to create that honeycomb feel of it switching between that orangey gold and yellow believe you me guys i've tried tons of different combinations and nothing compares to the race yellow with this car the bright orange does look pretty decent i'm not gonna lie as you guys can see on screen however as soon as i hover over race yellow bang this paint job literally comes alive it looks like a completely different color to the one that we started off with and like i always say to you guys i don't just post out any old paint jobs because i like the paint jobs to be very unique and special that i will personally be using and i think we can all agree this is a very nice combination however once you guys have applied the pleasant simply go ahead and apply the crew color to your secondary and then bang as you guys can see once it covers the entire car you get a better feel for the paint job a very unique golden yellow orange paint Job combination however the best thing about this paint job for me no matter what time of day it is whether it's sunny raining as you guys can see on screen the paint job still looks extremely unique and has the right balance of combining a dark color with a bright color just so it stands out completely always letting off a nice shimmer to it now usually i would go ahead and show off the paint jobs in all different types of lighting however this paint job looks so goddamn nice during the sun time i want you guys to go ahead and appreciate yourself on your own tv so if you guys do go ahead and try this paint job out do be sure to take a screenshot and tag me on the picture on twitter and i will be sure to drop you guys a like If you 
guys did see my previous paint jobs i did ask you guys what kind of color mixes you'd like to see me mix in the future and a load of you guys said green i do think this is a pretty popular color within gta 5 amongst crews and stuff however i have also been personally waiting for a good green to come along because if you guys have been watching my previous videos you'll know that i have a camo livery on my banshee so i am going to go ahead and do this on a banshee just to show you guys that it looks sick on both the zentorno or a banshee and i had a crew member also do it on a sand king which looked extremely nice because obviously the bigger the car is it reflects off more spots so as you guys can see i have got a camo livery over my banshee so the paint job won't fully stand out on my car that's why i showed you on the zentorno but nonetheless i do think these paint jobs look really nice some of the maybe basic liveries like the little lines or the pinstripes you can do nonetheless as this paint job is a milder color than the pink we don't need to apply the brush steel at the start you can go off and straight away apply the crew color as your primary once you've done that back out go down to metals hover over any metal for a few seconds back out again purchase a number plate for the car and now you guys can apply the pearlescent the pearlescent you guys want to apply is race yellow once again a few different pearlescents do look nice with this but you guys will see the difference of the car color once i approach race yellow it's like the paint job literally comes alive as you guys can see it fully seeps through the entire car looking like some sort of reptilian goblin color this is why i'm going to call this one slimy green because it's like lemon and lime yellow and green mixed together to create some mad fusion i would also suggest to the secondary as the crew color don't try and remix it because you guys want the um, pearlescent to see through the entire car and obviously as you guys can see now it's a much more clearer and i do think it looks pretty good with this camo like i said it's completely up to you whether you want to put a livery over it but as you guys saw with the zentorno even with no livery this paint job is extremely nice so if you guys are looking to get this paint job here is the rgb code you can see on screen right now and as usual i'm also going to leave this down low in the description in case you guys want to come back at a later date it'll be very easy for you guys to find however i thought i'd show you this quickly on a banshee without delivery as you guys can see some of you guys may think it looks better some may think it looks worse nonetheless i think we can all agree it looks extremely sexy definitely one of the best i have done guys that have been subbed to my channel for a while now you'll know that i used to do paint jobs well over a year and a half about two years ago and one of the best style of paint jobs are the chromatic paint jobs where you guys can apply chrome a crew color and a pearlescent on the same car now these paint jobs can look insane if you get the color right however to get the right crew color to actually stand out on the chrome is extremely hard believe you me for the last few months i've been trying a shit ton of colors with different chrome overlays and they just haven't been working however earlier in the week as you guys can see on screen right now i was able to find an insane red which complements the chromatic trick extremely well as well as the pearlescent overlay which does make it change throughout the entire map of the Day, as you guys can see right here the pearlescent is more an effect at nighttime because you get this almost fading chrome effect which looks really cool in my mind you don't get nothing like it unless you use the chrome trick and as you guys can see even when you drive under bridges or you're underground the car turns into a completely different beast giving this like chromatic matte effect to it looking very very smooth but as you guys can see here a lot of the chrome color tricks will look 100 chrome you'll probably be able to see the crew color slightly so the fact that this crew color stands that's so god that much it's got to be one of the best chrome colors to be using now usually i like to give you guys suggestions on certain paint jobs that work best on certain cars last week's paint job worked good on all cars as i explained however for this week's chromatic paint job i would suggest maybe doing it on a lamborghini or a sport slash supercar because you kind of want the car to have lots of dimensions to it lots of vents and cuts because what that actually does is it helps the reflection from the sunlight and the chrome with the crew color as you guys can see it's like it's always sparkling on my screen right now even though it isn't even peak sunshine in my game it's like 5 p.m right now and the car is still sparkling like a beast so for that reason i'm going to call this paint job chromatic red ruby because if you guys aren't aware red rubies usually change between a pink and a red blooded color always flicking through colors kind of like how this paint job does perfectly describing it nonetheless to get this chromatic red ruby paint job you want to grab the car you want to apply it to take it over to benny's or ls customs now the first thing you guys want to do is select respray and put the primary base color as chrome now if you guys are doing this paint job on a car that's got a secondary color or to apply the secondary main color as chrome now once you guys have got chrome on both the primary and the secondary you want to back out go back to primary you want to go down to metallics and you just want to hover over the top metallic for about 10 to 15 seconds 
do not select this metallic just do as i'm doing on screen just be hovering over it for about 10 to 15 seconds now once you guys have done that back out and purchase anything for your car so as you guys can see i'm just purchasing a number plate now once you guys have purchased something for your car go back to respray go to primary and then you want to apply the pearlescent over the chrome so as you guys can see the pearlescent is already kind of seeping through the chrome looking pretty sick as it is but this is nothing compared to the finished product the pearlescent you guys want to select for this paint job is going to be race yellow make sure you guys select race yellow or if you don't have race yellow then you can choose the normal yellow but it must be a yellow for this paint job to reach its full potential now once you guys have applied the yellow back out and simply apply the crew color over the pearlescent and the chrome and bang as you guys can see you can already see the red seeping through a shit ton inside of my garage and you can never see these colors seeping through in ls customs or bennies they usually look very hard to see however already in this strong line you can see it seeping through just showing you that this is one of the strongest chromatic tricks now once you guys have applied the crew color to your primary back out go to your secondary and also apply the crew color to your secondary now here's the rgb code for this red ruby paint job if you guys do want to go ahead and get it however that is going to do it for me guys three awesome paint jobs that all of you guys can get as of right now in gta 5 online hopefully you guys do appreciate me including three paint jobs rather than just one in this video and if that is something you guys do want to see in the future do be sure to drop a like down below and as soon as this video reaches the thousand likes like i said i'll post a new paint jobs video straight away however that's gonna do it for me guys thanks a lot for watching and i'll see you in my next video peace